G'day guys. All right, so here's the homepage of your SketchUp Activities and Tutorials Google Classroom. Um, you may find over you know, the next few weeks when you use this that this homepage here starts filling up with you know, people talking in the classroom. <coughs> Sorry, just ignore all that. Whenever you go to Google Classroom, I want you to go straight to Classwork up here. Right? This is the place you're always gonna use. This is where all the good information and stuff is, where your videos are and your booklet is. Now, before we get started, we need to actually set up a folder structure on our computer somewhere where we can save this booklet and we can save all the SketchUp activities as we do them. So what we need to do is go to our File Explorer icon down here, click on that. Now, mine's gonna look a little bit different to yours because I've got a lot of uh, random things on my computer. If you're on a school computer, I want you to go to this PC. There should be a, um, a thing on the left where you can click this PC. And you should have, I haven't got one here because I'm on a, um, my own computer, but you should have a drive. That's your student drive. It should say your first name, dot last name, and then you drive or something like that. It should just, you should find your student drive. That's where you're gonna to wanna to save your work into a drive like that. If you're on a computer at home, um, just use the desktop, okay? Just um, use a folder, on your, make a folder on your desktop to set up a folder structure in there. I'll show you an example of how to do it um, on the desktop. So we wanna right click, New folder, yeah, and we want to call it CAD activities. I've already made one previously, so I'll call this um, CAD activities one. Okay, we use that one. I'll get rid of that. CAD activities one. If you're on a school computer, you're going to go into your. I'll pretend this is my student drive, and it should just show up something like this. You might already have some folders in there. You might not, but what you're going to do is right click, same thing, make a CAD activities folder. Okay, I've got one here, Cat Activities 1. We we'll use that one for the time being. Right, you just need a folder where you can save your booklet and you can save all the work as you do it. Okay, once you've got that folder set up, um, we're going to move on to the next bit. If you got lost at any point during that, um, just rewind the video, go back, look how to set up a folder, and then you can resume the video. Okay, so we'll just minimize that for now. First thing you'll need to do is go to the CAD Activity booklet um, part of your classwork, click on that. And CAD Activity Booklet PDF is what we want to click on. Okay, so we need to actually download this booklet so that we can access all the drawing activities that we're going to be doing. There's a fair few pages, um, but there's tutorial videos for all of them. Um, to download this booklet, we need to go up here and click on this little printer icon, and it should open up a new window. Right, then there's a little download icon up here. Right, we go to the download icon, You'll just need to um, go on the left-hand side of the page. And if you've made your folder on your desktop, double click on that folder to save it in there. If you made it in your student drive, you just need to find your student drive. So mine is over here and it's in CAD Activities 1, right? So that's where we're gonna save this. It comes up with a really funny name like that. That's fine, just click on it and call it CAD Activity, Oops. right? CAD Activity Booklet and save. Great. <clears throat> now, once we've downloaded our CAD activity booklet, that's in there. I'm gonna show you guys how to get started using um, SketchUp on the desktop version. So click on the um, next video and that should show you how to get started on that.